are the strangest things found on Google Maps. Bye. Did the Google car hit the donkey? It sure seems like it. Poor donkey. They really made an ass out of him. This next one kind of reminds me of my mixtape. It's also fire. 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 Honestly, I hope everything turned out okay. Uh, maybe not for the guy on the right, though. Who doesn't love a good Halloween? The worst thing about it? It's just a prank, bro. If you've ever been on the receiving end of a TP attack, you know how hard it is to clean all that stuff up. Impossible! And if it rains, the TP gets all mushy and soggy, and then it's impossible to clean up, and, and it gets everywhere, and it's sticky, and... Ah! Have you ever looked up at the clouds and thought you saw a bunny or some kind of figure? Have you ever thought that those figures probably look down on Earth and see something else? This rock formation kind of resembles a man with some awesome looking headgear. And the road leading up to the top of the mountain kind of looks like some sick skull candies too. Mine, 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 and they said the children are our future. Here we see two little kids, or should we say hoodlums, attack poor, lovable Gumby. What provoked this attack? And is that a shoe in his hand? The story of why this person dressed as Gumby is being attacked by these two middle school aged boys is unclear. Nobody has yet to come forward with the backstory to this crazy, hilarious picture. Emergency delivery. This crazy photo captured the attention of many people all over the world. Here you can see a woman lying on the sidewalk while a man holds up her newborn child. Bystanders looked both utterly confused and concerned. This photo comes out of Germany and had many people question whether it was real or not. At first, many sources reported the shocking image is real, but they were shut down with reports of it all being fake. Real or not, this picture is definitely shocking. Imagine walking down the street and seeing this in someone's yard. This photo captured in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania is odd to anyone looking at it. There's no explanation as to why this whole raw chicken is placed in someone's yard. Some say it's probably an elaborate joke or perhaps a work of art. Either way, this one has us all scratching our skulls. Alien resident. That is creepy. This photo, taken in Nancy, France, spread across the interwebs like wildfire. This prompted internet sleuths to investigate what the creature truly was. People theorized that it was some sort of internet made up cryptid or even an alien. So what is this disturbing monstrosity? A statue. Yup. Three. Hold up, I don't want any trouble. Take a look at Timmy here with what looks like a handgun. This kid must have had it being pushed around in a stroller. And now, the kid is taking the situation into his own hands. I wonder what his demands were. Listen here, Gramps. Give me all the candy you got. And no more bedtimes. Nerd fight. You can see here an epic battle unfolding in front of your very eyeballs. It looks like Harold and Clark are at it again. <laughs> Clark is defending his honor from the tyranny of Harold's dark barbaric legion. Yeah, I would say tyranny. It's best just to let him go at it until one of them has an asthma attack and needs their inhaler. Wrong neighborhood! Have you ever taken a wrong turn in a bad neighborhood? This Google Earth driver apparently took a wrong turn into this nightmare. Imagine what the driver was thinking when he was confronted by what looks to be four sketchy horror film antagonists. Was this an elaborate prank? It's just a prank, bro! A roadside robbery? Or something worse? Take a look at this, uh, girthy type of... Oh God, why? <laughs> I don't want to say it. Take a look at this uh, girthy craft of architecture. There's something about it that's just majestic. This phallus shaped church is located in Dixon, Illinois. And apparently it's a big deal. I wonder how many people could pack into this building. Google Earth is a state of the art piece of technology that helps millions of people get around this crazy planet. But take a look at this screenshot from Google Earth. Something must have went wrong when rendering this photo. Maybe... A gl glitch tricks? A glitch in the matrix? A glitch in the matrix? Two! 
At first glance, it may seem like dead bodies were just dumped in the trash. But not to worry, if you take a closer look, you'll see that it's several mannequins made from casts that include plaster and fiberglass. The strangest part is how the mannequins are placed at the trash site. The mold's positions looks too realistic to a real body, but it is unclear as to who left these behind, leaving so many unanswered questions. Speaking of bodies, a California dad was shocked when he discovered how easily searched his son's body was found on Google Maps. The murder scene was clearly visible on screen, and in the middle showed his son's lifeless body. The incident happened back in 2009, when the 14-year-old was found shot next to a pair of train tracks. Google Maps' vice president, Brian McClendon, has taken action to remove the image. But this goes to show how easily it is to access these private images. But on the lighter side of things, when it comes to saving the world, we have a superhero for every need. It seems like their secret lair was busted by Google Maps. Whatever it is they're celebrating, we can at least attest that we'll be safe from any shenanigans. Everyone is here, including Thor, Hulk, Captain America, and even Buzz Lightyear. On an even brighter note, an image caught by Google Maps shows a prank in action. How many people does it take to stick a post-it note on a car? In this case, apparently two. And what makes it even funnier is that they probably don't know that they're being caught on camera. So next time you're walking down the street, just be aware of your surroundings, because what might be a private moment might be out there for everyone to see. Plus, you'll never guess if you're on camera. Including this picture, it's man versus bear. And we're not talking about bear grills either. This accidental picture taken on Google Maps shows the best method to chase away a bear on your property is to chase it off with a baseball bat. They seem to be headed towards Highway 365. So if you're going that direction, it's probably best to stay away. What? If you search Miyoshi Japan, you might not notice anything too different at first. Once you zoom in a little bit closer, you notice some people sitting outside on some benches. After further examination, you'll notice their faces aren't blurred as usual. Why is this? Well, it turns out this village isn't the way it seems, and everyone sitting down are actually dolls. Eerie but true. Nami Japan. After the Fukushima meltdown took place, everyone was forced to leave their homes in what's known as the Fukushima Exclusion Zone. Everyone except Google Earth, of course. Here we see on Google Maps how completely empty this town is and is quite frightening. It'll give you a real idea of what the apocalypse might look like. Nami is in the early stages of being abandoned and it appears to be one of the more modern ghost towns. As you explore though, you'll also notice people conducting experiments on the radiation here. Murder victim. With all that exploring that's needed on Google Maps, is it possible they could have captured a live murder on camera? Possibly yes, but this time it seems to be a prank. When people get the word of the Google streetcar coming through their neighborhood, they're eager to get those 15 minutes of fame. These pranksters here fake the murder in Edinburgh, Scotland. Hopefully Scotland Yard doesn't investigate this one too closely because it's a prank, apparently, or is it? Scarecrow Army. This one must be frightening for anyone who decides to do a little bit of Google Earth exploring in Finland. What appears to look like a bunch of creepy people standing in the middle of a field is actually a bunch of scarecrows that are out to get you. <laughs> Nevada National Security Site. Ever wonder what a nuclear wasteland looks like? Or how the land might look after it's been bombarded by a thousand nuclear bombs? Well, check the Nevada Security Site and see what strange things are going on here. It looks somewhat similar to the surface of the moon. The site was created in 1951 and is still in use. Small towns were built to test out the effectiveness of nuclear bombs, and then they were entirely obliterated. And located northeast in the security site is the infamous Area 51. You might not see any aliens here on Groom Lake, but you can imagine what goes on underground. Also, when you drop that little yellow guy over Area 51, it transforms into a flying saucer. Coincidence?